We are all guilty of complaining about our lives from time to time. And while there's no denying that each and every one of us needs to vent our frustrations, the truth is that we don't even realize how lucky we are. Most people's problems just pale in comparison with what the kids on this list had to go through. Today, I'll tell you about 10 unusual kids born with supernatural conditions. Be sure to stick around until the end of the video and check out our number one pick because that boy will definitely make you believe anything is possible. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for y'all that'll take five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you'll get 10 years of amazing luck. <laughs> Try it. It really works. Fu Wanggui. Extra neck vertebrae may be great for giraffes, but they can cause a great deal of trouble for humans. And 15-year-old Fu Wanggui from Beijing, China is proof of that. You see, this boy was born with three extra vertebrae in his neck. Because of this, Fu's neck is unusually long. He was also born with an abnormal spinal deformity called congenital scoliosis. On top of this, Fu suffers from Marfan syndrome, which causes abnormal elongations in the body. As you can imagine, Fu's neck garnered him a fair amount of unwanted attention with many people, calling him Giraffe Boy. Not only that, but he was in a decent amount of pain and was unable to walk properly. Poor boy. Fortunately, in 2015, a Chinese charity arranged for surgery to remove extra vertebrae. Hopefully, he's walking much easier now. Deepak Jandra The next boy on our list is the closest thing to a superhero. Meet Deepak Jandra, ladies and gentlemen a teenager who can take up to an incredible 11,000 volts of electricity and live to tell the tale. Yep, I'm not kidding. What this young man can withstand is nothing short of miraculous. Deepak discovered this incredible ability while fixing his mother's television. When he touched the live wires in the back, nothing happened. Not only did he survive this shock, but he also didn't feel it. And that, my friends, is how he realized he was special. Although calling Deepak special might be a little bit of an understatement, don't you think? I mean, how cool would it be to have this kind of superpower? Ever since he discovered his ability, Deepak has slowly tested himself out on higher voltages, working his way up to a whopping 11,000 volts. Despite his power, Deepak remains pretty much a normal teenager, although occasionally he'll put on a show for fellow villagers. And sometimes he would use his talent to fix electric problems in his village. I guess with great power comes great responsibility, eh? Ashik Gave Do you remember how painful it was when your wisdom teeth came out? Well, I assure you it is nothing compared to the pain of Ashik Gave, a 17-year-old teenager with 232 teeth. Yep, 232 teeth, you heard me correctly. Before realizing that he had a wide array of teeth in his gums, Ashik felt extreme pain in his face, head, and mouth. Doctors were baffled, but then they did an x-ray and finally found out the complete number of teeth. Yes, just like you, everybody was shocked. It was all about a severe case of complex odontoma, a very particular medical oddity. In order to pull the teeth out, it was necessary to undergo seven hours of surgery, even with a hammer and chisel. Nihal Bidla Nihal is just like any other 13-year-old kid. He loves to play games on his gadgets, spends his time dreaming, and wants to ride his favorite cycle. In a tragic real-life case straight out of Benjamin Button, this Indian boy named Nahil Bitla suffered from progeria, a disorder that causes the body to age at eight times its normal rate. He also had other health problems. He was not able to run, cycle, or play sports. Nihal had to drop out of school because of his health, but he learned to keep himself busy mostly by drawing and surfing the internet to learn new things. Sadly, Nihal passed away in 2016 at the age of 15 with the physical appearance and health problems of a 100-year-old man. His mind, however, always remained sharp and he impressed all of India with his generous spirit. In a final media interview, Nihal said, Above all, 
I hope that people know that our time here is special and life is incredibly beautiful in every single way. Adalia Rose. Just like Nihal, 13 year old Adalia Rose from Austin, Texas, also suffers from progeria. But her condition didn't stop her from becoming an internet sensation with millions of followers all over social media thanks to her hilarious videos that showcase her awesomeness. I mean, take a look at these videos and judge for yourself. She's adorable, isn't she? No wonder she got the nickname Diva. Adalia shares videos on everything from her love of makeup to video blogs of her life, inspiring others to live to their fullest. Kaylee Halko. Kaylee and Lindsay are two of only 54 children worldwide with an incredibly rare disease called progeria. Kaylee Halko was born with progeria, but despite looking eight times older than her actual age, she's living her life and living better than most of us. She has gathered a faithful fan base thanks to the app musical.ly, where she posts short video clips of her lip syncing in her bathroom. She also has a faithful Instagram following of over 200,000 people. Considering that those with progeria often don't make it past the age of 14, Kaylee is certainly pushing through. Her Instagram is full of glimpses of her adventures, and she continues to inspire people all over the world. Charlotte Garside. Take this off. Try it on you. <laughs> <laughs> What's he doing? At just two feet tall and less than nine pounds, Charlotte Garside is the world's smallest girl. She suffers from a condition called primordial dwarfism, which was developed at the embryonic stage. When she was a baby, Charlotte was only 0.82 feet tall and weighed less than 1.10 pounds. Can you imagine? Despite her condition, Charlotte still lives as normal of a life as possible. She even manages to ride a horse with the rest of her family. Don't get her wrong, she may seem fragile, but she is a real fighter. At birth, doctors said she would live only a year. However, she resisted and grew up like she is now. The Girl Who Lives in a Bowl 19-year-old Rama Haruna has lived almost her whole life in unbearable pain. 19-year-old Rama Haruna from the city of Kano in Nigeria has spent her whole life in a plastic bowl. You see, Rama is suffering from a mysterious condition that caused her arms and legs to stop growing, leaving her with limited mobility and in constant pain. Rama's family does their best to move her around using a plastic bowl. The cause of her condition is not yet known, and Rama's family has worked tirelessly to find a diagnosis. Specialist medical testing is expensive, and the family hopes to get the attention of a charity to help give Rama a better quality of life. Despite the challenges she faces, the brave teen is full of hope for her future. Evan Fasciano. The condition I have is unknown. Unknown. I don't know where it's going. Five-year-old Evan Fasciano from Connecticut has a rare disease that causes his skin to grow at 10 times its normal rate. Known as harlequin ichthyosis, the condition means Evan is living his whole life at risk. What does that mean exactly? Well, Evan burns through calories very quickly as the body produces more and more skin. In addition, he must be bathed constantly to remove old skin and be covered in creams and ointments to prevent cracking and infections. He is also unable to sweat, meaning that he can overheat very easily. Unfortunately, there's no cure for this disease, but that doesn't stop Evan from living life to its fullest. Jackson Buell. Hi, buddy. You're just in a snuggling kind of mood this morning, mm -hmm. aren't you? I love you, bud. This is an amazing story about an incredibly strong, brave, and inspirational kid called Jackson Buell. You see, Jackson was born with an extremely rare condition that left his skull half flat and prevented part of his brain from forming. Most of the children with this condition die soon after birth, but Jackson managed to defy all odds. 
His development is nothing short of miraculous. His parents were told their son wouldn't develop motor skills like speech or smiling, but Jackson proved them wrong. He can say mama and dada, and sometimes I love you to his parents. Jackson became an internet sensation in December 2015 when a Facebook photo of him with Santa Claus went viral. The family received dozens of presents from strangers and more than $162,000 in donations. Which one of these kids impressed you the most? Let me know in the comments below and I'll handpick and feature your comments in the next video. Look out for your comment.